So this was posted by Sean Etiquette of Windows Central. And obviously, all it is is Windows 11 on the Galaxy Z Fold 4. It's not actually Windows 11. It's a launcher. There's many of these launchers, many of these launchers in the Play Store. You can download them. any Android phone. Duo 1, Duo 2, Z Fold 3, Z Fold 4, S22 Ultra, you name it. If it's Android, you can run it. And there's two different versions. Obviously, you can run it like this, or you can mimic the uh, Microsoft OS from back in the day with the tiles. Launcher 10. Love the launcher. Can't stress that enough. Absolutely love the launcher. But the question is, should you run, or should it be able to run, Windows 11 on the Galaxy Z Fold 4? Because Z Fold 4 is a little bit different than Duo 1 and 2. So I was recently able to get... Duo 1 to run Windows 11. Thankfully, a coder on Twitter known as Gusto3000 posted a tutorial on how to do it. Then the beautiful man himself, Shane Craig, went ahead and took that tutorial and made a video on it. Thank you, because I would not have been able to do it if I if it wasn't for him. So because of that, I was able to go ahead and run Windows 11 on the Duo 1. And I'm talking about actual Windows 11, not a launcher, guys. Do command prompt, I can boot my phone into Windows 11 whenever I want. <coughs> Absolutely awesome. But of course, it's still limited. It's not fully capable of running it. And obviously, there are limitations. You are splitting your storage in half. You're dis mimicking your display on both sides. It's a cool gimmick to look at, but there's nothing you can really do yet with it. But here's the Z Fold 4. The big difference between the Z Fold 4 and the Swift Steel 1 2 is the Z Fold 4 has 12 gigabytes of RAM. It has a very good processing unit behind it. So it has the power. Way more power than the, than the Surface Steel 1 and 2. <coughs> and of course, it already has Samsung DeX built in. Now, Samsung DeX, you do need a monitor to actually use. So it's not as mobile as the ability, for example, to boot into Windows, right? This would be absolutely awesome. Because now you have a company, Samsung, who doesn't give up on their products, who doesn't abandon what they create, that could push this Windows 11 on a Z Fold 4. Now... I will say it like this, you know, it would look a lot better on the Windows on the Surface Duo um, Galaxy Z Fold 4 because of the fact it's all one display rather than it being two separate displays connected by a hinge. I just don't know how many people would actually use Windows 11. I mean, there are a lot of people who have Samsung phones who don't even know Samsung DeX is a thing. They don't even know if they connect their uh, phone to a, a monitor, they can have a Linux-based system in front of them that's pretty much the equivalent of a PC. Maybe you don't know that. Um, now, I will say another thing is, of course, that $1,800 price tag could become so much more reasonable if it did dual boot. Now, I will say... Let's say hypothetically, right? I just want to put the hypothetical out there, right? Let's say it was the same thing as Samsung DeX where you had to plug into a monitor and then you got Windows 11. I wouldn't like it as much. And the reason why is because the whole idea of dual booting, booting into Android, then you can boot into uh, Windows 11 too. It just gives you the flexibility of being away from your computer, right? Away from, you know, any type of, tethered downness that you would have by having a you know having to connect to a monitor or a pc and that's why a lot of people don't know what samsung dex is because they're like why would i use that when i have the ability to put my pc and my laptop here and i'm about to use that anyway it's an interesting concept an interesting idea and you know like i said before the whole point of windows 11 on the duo one duo two is because it would hopefully Microsoft did pick up the idea. It'd be very much optimized for that platform, right? It's Microsoft Windows platform, but Google could do it. 
And if Google did go ahead and pick up the idea and pick it up, I think they could do wonders with it because they would actually stick to it. It's already running Android 12L, which automatically makes it amazing phone there. Then you got Windows 11. And if you can get applications optimized for this Z Fold 4, you can make it literally the best phone in the market. And you can really justify the $1,800 price tag. Hey, listen, we have a phone that dual boots into Windows and Android. It has 12 gigabytes of RAM. It has the latest and greatest processing unit inside. I'm be honest with you. And then the outside display, oh, <coughs> the outside display could use, be utilized so much with a Windows 11 system. You could literally have the outside display have the old Microsoft Windows OS system where it just shows the tiles. And then you open it up and you have a full on desktop PC in front of you. You know, this might just be a, a dreamer here, right? A dreaming guide or a dreaming idea. But tell me that would not be beautiful. Tell me that would not be an amazing concept. Windows well, pretty much launched a 10 on the outside, but an actual full on built in system, a built in launcher that lets you be able to fully, fully, fully customize it. It's fully meant for the actual phone. Again, like I said, just an idea, just a concept. Love to hear your opinions down below, guys. Tell me down below your thoughts and opinions, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.